Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for being here. So I have a Goodwill haul to show you guys. Yes, I'm really excited to show you what I bought at Goodwill. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I'm so excited. Okay, so for those who are new to my channel, I this girl, this girl right here loves to shop Goodwill. Um, yeah, so if you like to shop Goodwill, this is, um, I think you'll like this channel <laughs> because I shop Goodwill a lot. Like seriously, they, they all pretty much know my name. I think at Goodwill, like it's yeah, it's I love it. I love it there so much. So, um, but I shop. I do other hauls as well, but um, I love Goodwill. It's Goodwill. Oh, I find so many good things there. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started in this haul. Okay, so you, I've been showing. <laughs> this has been peeking out in the back of my video for the last couple of videos. This is. Um, a lampshade I found you guys at Goodwill for only a dollar forty nine. There's the price right there. It's like brand new, you guys. Like seriously, it's so pretty, right? So I mean, I have you know a lamp that'll work with this, and it's just so pretty. And like there it goes how it connects in the inside. But it's just I like that polka dot look, and I think it's really cute for fall, winter, Christmas time. It looks really like. Festive because it's the uh, polka dots kind of have like a metallic look to it, so it's really really cute. A dollar forty nine, you guys, for a lampshade. I know. I'm like, what? That's why I love the Goodwill. <laughs> I know. I say it all the time. I really do. I say it all the time. Okay, then um, I bought. Here's another one. One of my daughter, two of my daughters really like the Adidas brand, like really a lot, and um, so I got her this this is an adidas sweatshirt um and uh it is super super cute you guys it looks brand new right it's like silky feeling to it and it was um kind of expensive but adidas full price is like this sweatshirt full price would have been 40 ish dollars maybe 50 probably 50 more on more of like 50. this was 8.99 but it's so cute, you guys. It's a hooded sweatshirt. I mean, really, really cute. And um, it'll look really cute on my daughter. And this, for size-wise, uh, just so you know how this runs, this is a size 14, 16 in youth. So, because I always like want to know what sizes are too. So if I want to order something from like Adidas online, I know exactly what size to get. So what size to get. Okay. Then I picked up these snow pants. So for one of my daughters for the snow, because in California, we only have to drive like in the snow season. We don't ever get snow in Elk Grove. Like there, no, there's no snow in Elk Grove. Um, you know what? I'm just going to tell you a really quick story though about Elk Grove. <laughs> you guys won't believe this. Like if you don't believe me, look it up. <laughs> you can look it up in the news. It's like legit real. Um, there was a man who in my town, like a few days ago, went to use the toilet. N no joke. No joke, you guys. Like, this is serious, serious. He opens up the toilet, and there was a six-foot python in his toilet. <laughs> it was so crazy. He opens up the, I don't, I think he opened up the lid. I don't, I don't think it was open. And then there's a snake. And so they had to call out a snake um, person to come get it out. And this, and it, they actually ha showed the snake, and it's like a six-foot long python. You, uh, I think it was a python snake, a boa constrictor. I think it was a boa constrictor. But like as long as my arms, you guys, in the toilet, in his toilet in my town. I'm like, oh my gosh, like what? What? Like seriously. So yeah, Elk Grove, I search it up, you'll see there was a snake. Like a not just a garden snake, not like a little tiny snake. No, it was like a python or a boa constrictor. Ooh, yeah, I'm like, yeah, I, I don't know where I digressed from from this, but I just thought of it and I had to share you the, the most recent news that is like pretty interesting. Okay, so anyway, um, so these these are snow pants for um, wintertime because like I said, that's where I was going. Okay, so we live in Elk Grove. Elk Grove never gets snow, but um, we have family that we, that gets snow and they live about two hours from here. So we go up in the snow in the wintertime and we can play in the snow. And so like Lake Tahoe, we can even go to Lake Tahoe and Lake Tahoe is about a two hour and a half, two hour drive from Elk Grove. So we can even go there. We've done that before and played in the snow. And um, so there's lots of things to do uh, to get to the snow besides not getting at our house. So anyway, I picked up snow pants. Um, these are the ones that zipper off. So uh, see how they zipper at the middle right here? There's like a seam. So I guess you can make them shorter. I didn't realize that till now. Um, but they're really beautiful color, right? Like that, like ice blue. Uh, and these are made by Oshkosh. 
Oshkosh right here, Oshkosh right there. And they were $3.99, you guys. That's it. $3.99. So, like, that is a really good deal for snow pants. Like, seriously. And these are a size 14, 16. So, this will be uh, for one of my older daughters. So, really, really good deal. Yeah. Like, full price, those these pants would be, like, I'm guessing $40? $40? All right. So, then... Um, oh, by the way, guys, I'm wearing two of my rings that Theoni from Thrifty Diva sent me. Um, it's this one and this one. Um, I did, posted a video, you'll see before this one, of she sent me beautiful, beautiful friend mail. So, and these were in it. So, um, I'll include that video in the back of this one. Um, if you want, she sent me some gorgeous jewelry. So, I'm wearing this, um, yeah, I, I love these rings. So, anyway, okay, I love it all, what she sent me. So, it's just, like, amazing. So, anyway, um... I hope you can see these too, Theoni, if you're watching. I hope um, that you can see these so because they're so pretty. Anyway, all right, back to this. Okay, so um, then I got, so I love buying jackets at Goodwill because they're always such a, they're usually, usually such a really good deal, you guys. So this was a Children's Place puffer jacket uh, for my son, Roman, and this is only one dollar what like, yeah one dollar and 99 cents i know i had to double take it when i looked at the tag i was like what 199 so looks brand new you guys looks brand new this is a size five six um little puffer jacket for my son it's like really really cute isn't it super cute i love that navy blue for my for him my son has some really pretty blue eyes so it looks anything navy blue looks really really good on him so um Oh, I picked this up for me, you guys. Okay, so <laughs> it says Abercrombie. I'll stand up. Abercrombie. So isn't that so cute? Um, it feels like um, it could be like cashmere or something, but it's not. It's actually, it's machine washable, you guys. Literally, I, I checked the tag at the store. I was like, what? It's machine washable? Sold. You know, otherwise I wouldn't have bought it because um, I don't like running to the dry cleaners if I don't have to. So, um, but Abercrombie and Fitch, this is a size large. It's a pretty cute, cute sweater for fall. Um, I thought so. It's got like a stretch to it. And it's it's pretty cute, you know? I think so. I hope you guys like it too. Uh, pricing, this was $6.99. $6.99. Then the back is also like that. Okay, so you'll see me buying a lot of sweaters because I love sweaters, you guys. Um, okay, then I got... This for my daughter, this jacket is so pretty. I wish it fit me, you guys. This is so, so pretty. Look at this pink, pink. Okay, I have to put my glasses on. I can't see. I'm making sure it's showing in the video. Um, the, this is a pink jacket. I'll go ahead and stand up so you can see it as well. Isn't that so, so cute? The color is so fabulous. I wish that I could wear this. Um, this is from the brand... Um, Zara. Okay, here's the back. It's like got such a um, royal look to it. It looks like something like, it just looks like something from, um, I don't know how to explain it. It looks like a princess cut, like a, from the, like a 1900s, like a pea coat. It's so pretty. Like, look at the back. Isn't that so cute with the high buttons on the back? And this is a size 13, 14. This is Zara Kids, which I think is a name brand. I'm not for sure. But anyways, regardless, it's super, super cute. And I wish I could find a coat like this for me in pink. So, isn't that precious, you guys? It's so, so, so cute. So cute. And it was $5.99. So, perfect price for a perfect coat. It's so darling. Then, um, I got, let me find it here. Where did it go? right here okay so I as you guys know I love rings and I do shop Goodwill rings <laughs> sorry I'm getting stuck here on my skirt so I found a ring another ring I just can't get enough rings and jewelry I just love it all so you guys are gonna love this I felt I couldn't believe this like what I found this like no joke guys this is an elephant an elephant ring like seriously and uh, yes it's I, I'm like what an elephant ring and its trunk is up which is good luck my husband's from India um, and um, whenever a trunk is down it's bad luck when you see an elephant in their um, 
in the Indian culture. So when the trunk is up, it's good. It's like good luck. So you want to buy an elephant with its trunk up, not down. So um, the elephant, his trunk is up. See that? It is so cute. And it's like an, it's like a piece of art, really. It, look at the rhinestones on its back. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll go ahead and put it on so you can see it on. It's just, I love big, huge, fun rings. And this was $3.49, $3.49. And um, it's a big, big ring, huge ring. It's a statement piece, for sure a statement piece. I'm going to show you, <laughs> it's so big. I know it's like a little, a little obnoxious maybe, like too big for a lot of people's taste. But I, you know, I don't think so. <laughs> I think it's perfect. So isn't that pretty? So I've got a little elephant on my finger. So I love elephants, you guys, you know, and he's just so beautiful. He has a crown on him. He's like, just, I love elephants. I think they're very beautiful animals, very beautiful, beautiful animals. Like if I could have a pet elephant, I would like seriously, you know, they say elephants never forget. I just, I, I have like a connection with elephants. I think they're just beautiful, 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 magnif magnificent creatures. So yeah. I just love them. I just love elephants. Okay, now the next thing, and that was $3.49. The next thing I picked up was this. I think you guys are gonna think this is pretty cool. Okay, so this was really cool actually. I love shopping in like the hardware area. Like they have like knickknacks, like, um, like umbrellas and like shelves. Like they have this area in the Goodwill, it's like just random, just like random stuff, but it's household stuff. So I found this medallion you guys like really this is a ceiling medallion okay it says that but it says can also it says create your own finishes it can you can you know marbleize it you can color wash it uh crackling stenciling that type of thing but it says it can be used for other things besides a medallion a medallion medallion i can't say the word so the centerpiece comes out see that but it says standard it says used to cover up Holes where no light fixture exists, lightweight, easy to install, nailable, stainable, and paintable. So you guys, I love, you guys know that I love the Victorian period so, so much. And like the Victorian Rococo period, they're all about molding so much, like moldings everywhere you look, like it was just so ornate. So <laughs> this is my little slice of Victorian right here, as I get a little bit of Victorian in my house right here from having this. So um, I want a medallion all over my lights, like everywhere if I could, I would, I would. Literally would do that, but I'm not going to be able to do that probably. So I mean, I could, but then we'd have to get our electrician out and they have to take out all our um, light fixtures and then you have to pay to have put it back up. It's a very expensive process. But this, I was thinking about covering up an outlet we have in our house. So this is kind of how it looks size-wise, okay? So we have a, um, we have a uh, outlet that I wanna cover, you know, like I'm saying. So I'm gonna use it for that. So I thought that was really spectacular. And it was only, like, you guys, this is really cool. If you wanna see if this is like on Amazon or something, because I might order more of these. I didn't know that they come in this size and they could be used for other things besides just, you know, a ceiling um, medallion. So price-wise, this was only $1.49 dollar the price is right there dollar 49 so pretty good deal excited about that then I picked up okay I picked up this beautiful coat for my son as well like I said I love buying coats at Goodwill you guys it's just it's just they the prices you just cannot find anywhere else in my opinion for like coats and stuff so this is a beautiful coat it's the go dry material so it like wicks away moisture and that type of thing it says go dry on the back back there anyway um this is made by old navy active you guys old navy active and it was only for old navy for an old navy jacket it was only two dollars and 99 cents yes i know i'm like yes score that is a great deal i love the like design of it i love the two-tone it's just so cute it's light kind of lightweight so he can like you know he'll have a lot of jacket options for this year um, and like I said, and also like, um, you know, if they were to like misplace the jacket, we've done that before. Like we'll go out to dinner, our family of six, and one of them has left their jacket on the chair and then we drove away and it was like an hour away. It wasn't worth going back to get the jacket for. So we've done that before. Like we, you know, we have a lot of people in our family. It's hard to keep track of everybody. So, I mean, 
not, you know what I mean? It's hard to keep track of all the coats and stuff when it comes to like winter time. So <laughs> I can keep track of everybody. That's not what I meant. <laughs> I meant the clothing uh, when we go out, like the jackets and scarves and the hats and the mittens and the sunglasses. It's a lot when you have four kids to like remember everything. And my older girls can remember, but like my younger ones, you know, it's hard sometimes. So I mean, I would have done it. I think I probably have done that before. Left a jacket on a chair or something. So yeah. So for two ninety nine, I wouldn't feel. I'd feel sad if I left it behind, but I wouldn't be like heartbroken, you know, because it's two ninety nine. So then I had mentioned this in um, a previous video. Um, I went to Dollar Tree and picked up those circle batteries. I still need to put them in here to see if it works. But I did get okay. So I bought these are these are like collectibles, I believe. I looked up on eBay because I was like trying to figure out what they are. So I looked up on eBay and they're like selling for, I want to say one of them at least each or like 17 or more dollars each. And these are from the 90s, 80s or 90s. I have to double check. But they're called Cube World Mic or Mick? Cube World Mic? I'm not sure. Mick. And they were only, so they, they stick together. Let me, let me get them together. One of them does turn on. Okay, so see how there's a magnet? So they stick, let me stick them together for you guys to show you. Um, let me show you. Can I get it to work? There it goes, there it goes. Okay, it's stuck together there. See, it's sticking together. Then, okay, it's like, okay. So see how they stick together? So what they do is an image, one of these turns on. I think it's the hot pink one. I paid 69 cents, by the way, for these, 69 cents. And I still don't know if they work, the other two work. This one works though. This one does work. So you'll see like a little guy on the screen. Um, it does different things. Like, okay, he's like doing something weird right there. He's like dancing or something. So what happens is, is when you put them, turn them all on, they connect and they talk to each other. So like this guy will go over into this box and then he'll like, like there'll be a door in this, this box and he'll come over and he'll open it. It's like the weirdest thing ever, but it's like really cool. It's like early technology for like, I don't know, it reminds me of like a little mini computer. I don't know, but this is, oh, it's upside down, I think again, but, um, there it is. So if you look up on eBay, guys, these are worth money. And I was like, this is really cool. This is really cool. And it's something eclectic, something old school. Do you see the guy right there? He's doing something. Is he moving? Yeah, he's moving around. So they're supposed to like move around between each other and talk to each other. So I paid a total of like two something for all of them because they're 69 cents each, you guys. So they are on eBay. I'm like, that is really cool. They do make a rattling noise. And I'm like, why are they rattling? But they all do that, even the one that works. So I'm hoping the other ones do work. So he's like doing something weird again. He's like doing, he's like getting up, like this guy in there, this like computer guy. I don't know what he is doing. It's so random. It's, but I think I love old technology. Like I just, I think it's fun and it just takes you back to a simpler time, right? Like total simpler time. Like this would have been so high tech back in the 80s or 90s. This would have been so high tech. Okay. The last item I think that it is here is these two, yeah. So, okay, so I wanna show you this, you guys. I put batteries in them when I got home because I wanted to test them to make sure they work. You guys, these are gorgeous. Let me show you these. These I'm so thrilled to have found, like really, really thrilled. So first of all, look at how gorgeous they are. Just unlit, right? Like so pretty. The glitter, it's so beautiful, like all year round or even Christmas time only if I just want to put it up for Christmas, but I think these are going to go on my dining room table like all year round because they're just beautiful, simplistic, but beautiful. Okay, so they do work. I had no idea if they would work. It's a gamble I took because when you buy a Goodwill, um, usually at my Goodwill, I don't know if it's every Goodwill, but if you buy something that has, is electronic and it does not work, you have 24 hours to return it with the receipt. So I just took a gamble because it was $150, $150, that's $3 for both of these. So we're ready to see how pretty they are. They totally work. In fact, I don't think they were ever used. Like there's such like really good condition. Like I don't think they were ever used. Okay, so let me flip it on. Look at how it like glows like a candle. I'll go in closer so you can see. So it does that like, you know, moving look. So like what a candle would do, a flame. So, so pretty, right? And I'll turn this one on too so you can see it. I mean, this is something that is so practical and like great for like, um, you know, because I don't want to have a, a lit flame um, running all the time um, on my dining room table. So this is so pretty and so 
it's so simple, right? But so glamorous at the same time. It's hard to explain, but it's just an, a beautiful piece. So yeah, I think it's worth $3, right? Together. Yay. I'm so excited. I'll go in closer so you can see it. Like, I just appreciate stuff like this. Like, I mean, it's so cool. I don't know where this is from. I wish I could tell you. So if like you guys wanted to order it yourself, I cannot find out where this is from. This is the price, 149 149 so I have no idea where it's from. It's interesting though. It feels like it's something from like Target. I don't know. I It could be wrong though. It totally could be wrong. But um, yeah, guys. So that is it for my Goodwill haul. That combines everything, including the lampshade. Um, I'm just like, like loving Goodwill, guys. Loving Goodwill. So um, it's one of my happy places. <laughs> so anyways, thank you guys for joining me today on this video. I hope you guys are doing well. And um, I'll close the video for now. But um, till next time, I will see you guys tomorrow with my next video, okay? So till next time, everybody, take care. God bless. And I'll see you tomorrow. All right, guys. Bye.